Disturbing video posted on Facebook has gotten the attention of investigators at the SPCA. Now the video, which has gotten literally millions and millions of views, shows a Buffalo man using profanity and his dogs to actually clean up his house. Channel 2's Jeff Preval has been looking into this for us. And Jeff, what were you able to find out about this? Yeah, Scott and Mary Alice, now this video has actually gotten thousands of shares and comments. Now, there are multiple agencies that are aware of this video, not only the Erie County SPCA, but also Buffalo Animal Control and Buffalo Police. You got it, bitch. Come on, get up. The video scene here shows a buffalo man standing over one of his German shepherds, holding the dog's front paws, scooping trash off the floor and putting in a bin. Get up! You're not done. You're not rich. This goes on for nearly a minute. Then the man's second dog comes into view. You want some? Come on. He forces that dog to pick up trash, making the claim that his dogs always get into the trash and make a mess while he's out of the house. The video was posted on Aaron Riley's Facebook page, and the comment at the top of the post says, Told y'all I was going to do it. The video has gotten more than 7 million views and more than 112,000 shares. People on Facebook have expressed their disgust and praise. To me, it's basically abuse. Jay Deganji, who's been a dog trainer and groomer for 30 years, works at St. Francis Professional Grooming and Training in Buffalo. He says he was disgusted by the video. Seeing the garbage all over, the dog has no clue or no idea what is going on. What is the best way to train a dog to make sure that the dog's not getting into trash? The best way is to keep lids on your trash. Let's say the dog had a, a sensitivity to sound and a loud whistle or a clapping and you set this up as a training session. So you bring the garbage out, you set the can in the open and you walk away. The dog starts to go towards the garbage can and you make this sound, whether it be the clapping, a whistle blowing. In their mind, they're associating their action with this negative. And DeGangi says that it can be a long process to teaching a dog good manners. And he wants to point out that when he saw this video, he actually thought that, that causing this type of behavior can actually cause dogs to fear, hu fear humans. Now, the SPCA says that it has opened an investigation into the matter and would not comment further. Reporting live in the studio, I'm Jeff Preval, Channel 2 News. All right, Jeff, thank you. This week.